fans all around the world, welcome to your home, your home <laughs> of all the latest new rock albums reviews. Um, we are I'm PJ, and this is my wonderful panel to Chris, to Dom, to William, and to Simon. Welcome, guys. Hello, hello. Hi. So if you tune in for the first time, we're reviewing all the latest rock albums. We tell you what we feel for our listening pleasure. Okay, nothing technical. We're not technical people. We're not recording artists. We're nothing. We're just good old-fashioned rock fans that love to listen to all sorts of rock music. Um, and um, please hit the like and subscribe button before we kind of start. Leave a comment. Do you agree with us or not agree with us? Um so we review the albums, rate them out of five, and then we have a result show. Um, so each show is about ten minutes. So tune in, find out what you want. Um, we are reviewing sixty albums this month. There's a lot of reviewing eight with us, and today we are reviewing about us and uh, their album "Take a Piece." Who are about us? Well, they are an exciting new melodic hard rock band hailing from this is interesting, guys, uh, Nagaland, India. Mm. Uh, and more specifically from the district straits of Nagaland called Wukka, Land of Plenty. Their Frontiers debut self-titled release uh, to be released in, uh, was, on a, was in 2022. The band first formed in the winter of 2019, coming from varied musical backgrounds. The members of About Us have performing for the last 50 years or so in different bands and projects before coming together. Their collective musical tastes varied from blues, AOR, hard rock and so on. All of which is reflected in its uh, in their self titled debut. The band released their first single, Loaded Love, in 2020, followed later by another single, Rock Is Back, which is heralded by the editor of Poplar Daily in their area, uh, Murang Express. The band has released their first music video, Gimme Gimme, in late April 21, which reached almost half a million viewers in a short time. The song subsequently won two back to back awards in the Best Rock category uh, at the MG Nagaland Music Awards and the Music Awards of Nagaland 2021. Wrapping up a busy 21 for About Us, the band released their self-titled debut album in their home country and the second video music right now. But now they've moved on because now it's their second album and it's Take a Piece. Please, take a piece. Now, let's take a piece of Chris first of all, shall we? Let's hear Chris's dulcet tones. Chris, what did you think of About Us? Uh, so I, it's a mixed bag this one for me. Uh, so I think with their their first album about us, they were a bit more the sort of the a bit more melodic rock. They were a bit a bit more relaxed into it. With with take a piece, they've brought on more of the uh, the sort of the growl of the more hostile lyrics that I don't like so much. So there are some songs in there like Endure and Legion and a couple of others. I think Legion's the heaviest one that's in there for it. Um, but I, I wasn't a fan of. But the rest of the album, when you start getting into more things like Fire with Fire and some of the other other songs that are in there, it's a lot more my sort of cup of tea. There's some really complex guitar work, some brilliant sort of build, building up during the songs and the crescendos, crescendos as you go through. Um, yeah, it, it sort of gets your pulse moving. It's quite refreshing, actually, to listen to this one because there's the balance they strike in most of the songs is really good. They've gone a bit further into the, the sort of the heavier, um, sort of the, the ground and more hostile lyrics with this, but... When you come back from that a little bit, it's sort of a sweet spot that I quite like. I like the balance. I don't. I've got no problem with going, you know, metalcore and growler and stuff like that. But it needs to balance with the rest of the music. And I think they they go just a little bit too far the wrong side of the balance for me with this. But I did quite enjoy it. So yeah, it was quite a good one to listen to. Now it's not always about you, Tom. It's not always about you. Uh, in fact, for a nice change, Dom, it's about us. Uh, and in particular, really? the band about us. Uh, what did you think? Um, well, I mean, it, it, I enjoyed the album. I mean, it's full of energy. They're a quite young band, as you said, and there's like this hard, hard classic rock style, um, and with a twist, with a modern twist, which is but they call themselves experimental rock or something. That's their own definition of what they are. Um, uh, it's kind of um, hardcore light, I'd call it. It's kind of... <laughs> it's, the vocals were really strong. I, I really enjoyed the vocals. Um, and I, I thought it was a good kind of bridge into a hardcore scene. Legion was my standout track, Chris. I, I thought it was the best example. It's the most satisfying right, yeah. song on the album, mm -hmm. for me, anyway. I liked that style. Um, the whole twin lead guitar... 
Heavy Metal Fun 2, that's great. So it's almost like a bits and pieces of everything kind of chucked in together. Um, but actually, it was quite satisfying. So, yeah, I enjoyed it. Somebody who is always satisfying. Always. And that's William Hall. William, um, about us? What do you reckon? Uh, well, I I think, well, for my, my listening pleasure, as we, as we so love to say, it's it's trying to do too much, I think, of its of its experimentation. There's there's too many different things that don't really quite blend in the way that I think they'd hoped it to or hoped it would. Because it's it's just a weird contrast when you go from as we for the third time Legion, you go from something like that, which is it has those harsh, I like when the man screams and shouts at me very much, to this like high pitch whaley ish voice who sounds like he's had his Nuts trapped in a, yeah, you know, <laughs> somewhere, which is a bit of a weird contrast. Where, where would uh, he have his, William? Where, where would he have his nuts uh, trapped? I'll William? leave it up to uh, up to people's imaginations. <laughs> you know, lots of things happen on those stages, so there's lots of things to risk oneself in. Uh, <laughs> it's 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 fine. Like there's there's bits at work. A lot of it for me doesn't quite work, but it's. It's, it's trying. It's pulling bits from too many different places to, and it's it's not really, for my my opinion, worked as well as it could have possibly. But it's, yeah. Hope they find themselves. You know. Hope they find a sound that does work. But it's it's a bit too experimentally and out there for me. But it's yeah. It's all right. It's fine. Okay. Fine. So moving on to somebody who definitely found himself. Definitely, Simon Reed. Uh, not sure about that. All right, so <laughs> uh, about us, yeah, they were. Um, so I, in contrast to Will, which is very unusual for me, um, I really liked how much variety was in the album. <laughs> but I suppose it's also because um, spoilers: the rest of this month is quite a lot of uh, samey. Uh, so having this sort of variety throughout the album, and having this sort of mix and blends of um, styles was actually I, I quite enjoyed it for for listening through the album for review. It was very fun fun to have all these different styles uh, particularly um the one that really got me though i think is the track evh because it sounded just like journey um <laughs> i was like wait hold on has, has spotify smart shuffled me over to journey again or something you know um so yeah i quite enjoyed the variety the, the only problem for me in was that um, there was, as Nigel like to say, there was no hero track. I, there was nothing that I particularly latched onto um, that makes you want to, you know, um, that makes me want to sort of like stay with the band and put them on my favourites lists and stuff. But no, I mean, it's the kind of album that I wouldn't turn off if it was on. Like, I would enjoy it and listen to it, yeah, but it just is not like a shining favorite of mine but i'd i'd quite i'd quite like to see what else they do in future though I'm, I'm, i hope they bring out more albums and we get to review them again yeah i just i, I think it's a bit of everything uh my problem with this is one there was no hero track absolutely spot on again uh, I, and then i would go oh Legion, i hate that and then, oh, i like that oh that was all right oh i don't like that i had that for me there was too much um I, actually, I, I'd say there wasn't too much. Going. I do like hybrid kind of music, but for me, it was either they were either all on one thing, like you know, like they smash it in your face, which I don't like, and then a bit of Journey, which is okay. And yeah, it was just a bit of a mixed bag. That you know, it was an album that was just for me personally, just okay, um, without it being really stand out. I, I, you know, there was some some great production in there, um, and, and it was okay. It was just okay. Um, now obviously by the way we are missing one of us today which is Trish who puts a lot of effort into the show um, Trish um, by the way uh, just and, and it was very interesting um, I, I, I'll just take a, a little clip of what she said because it echoes what everybody else has said while this is a full on guitar drums hit you in the face rock I got lost in the album and what it was about as all the songs uh, all flow into one for me and I failed to take anything from it even a standout track so and there was no denying musically it was good and, and that kind of that's kind of, I thought I picked up on that because that seems to echo roughly what we do this is a really solid album um, with a lot of potential I think and, it, and perhaps it's one of those albums that would kind of grow on you but it was still good it was still good what do you think out there people your turn 
hit the like and subscribe button. Please leave a comment if you if you think about it, because it's uh, great to see um, bands coming from all across the world. We love it. Um, and yeah, thank you very much. Thank you to my wonderful crew, uh, to Chris, to Dom, to William, and to Simon. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.